Welcome back to the channel. Gropus here. Today I'm on the Lost Land server of Ultima Online. This is a classic rendition set in the T2A era of the game. If this is your first time joining the channel, hail and well met! I do videos for this server as well as Ultima Online Second Age, which is also another classic server. Sprinkle in some Hearthstone videos and also every once in a while some investment videos. Now today's topic is going to be bulk order deeds. This is something that was not in the T2A era originally, uh, but this server decided to add it to the game uh, to make it kind of nice for the players. So there's uh, two types of bulk order deeds. There are small bulk orders and large bulk orders. orders. So I'm going to do an example and there's also tailoring and blacksmithing so I'm gonna do an example for you for tailoring on a large just gonna grab uh, just like a 10 exceptional you just click the arrow to pull it out of your book I've got these book or books organized by what they are. Okay, so we're looking for a skirt, a shirt, and a bandana. So go to filter options, put this on 10, put it on exceptional, and hit apply, and that'll narrow it down. There are also scripts you could run to do this. I don't have a script for it. I just do it manual because I don't do this that often. Um, so, yeah, this is fine for me. So, there's our shirt. Now we need to find a skirt and a bandana. There's a bandana. And where is our skirt? have multiple books of these and some people will do these um, and just turn them in as the smalls you get less of a reward but you get uh, more flips or flips are like when you you turn them in um, as a small and then you can immediately get another bulk order deed uh, for that time frame ordinarily I think it's every four or six hours um, you can flip uh, four of those in a 24 hour period you can also purchase extra flips from uh, the platinum vendor there's our skirt okay now we need thigh boots uh yeah there's my leather book cool right there some of these i already have pre-filled Thigh boots are filled, shirt is filled, bandana is not, skirt is filled. Okay, easy. So you'll either make t 10 bandanas, um, or I've got a bunch of these boxes, or these pow uh, bags already made up. This is like my little bulk order deed warehouse here. So you double click the deed. You can combine this deed with the item requested. So you could, you got your bag here. You could take it and, you know, click on each one. But a better way to do it, and this is something I didn't find out until after I've been doing it for a while, is you can click on the bag itself and it'll suck out what it needs. Now, if this bag has exceptional and normal in it, it'll pull out the 10 exceptional that it needs. So, that's kind of a handy little tip there. And as far as the large goes, you click the combine, and then you just click on each deed. And so now, 
it has all your items in the large bulk order deed and everything is filled so now you can just turn it into the tailor um, so you might ask well how do I get a bulk order deed from a tailor well that's easy you just have to sell an item it could be uh, to the tailor you can sell a clothing item a uh, piece of a cloth whatever that vendor will buy and then he'll give you an option to get a bulk order deed uh, same thing with a blacksmith you can sell an ingot you can sell a weapon a piece of armor whatever so i do a lot of farming i, I just pick up magic uh, stuff and i id it later so i have these bags full of just you know magic clothes i'll just grab a few pieces and then same thing with armor and weapons so nothing goes to waste it's all just it all just turns into bulk order deed food that's how I do it but I used to if I ran out of that stuff I'll just make a bandana and sell it real quick or you know same thing with blacksmithing just make something low cost and sell it and I've got my blacksmith bulk quarter deeds in a different house should probably combine them to that one house I just haven't done it yet and so for these I'm gonna show you how to do the flips because I've already got some made up Well, blacksmithing there are several smalls that don't fit into larges like tier kite shields those don't fit into any large large is going to be like armor sets or weapon sets well, there's a large that I filled colored shields This little bag is there. All these are already filled. Okay. And then recall to my favorite town to turn in bulk order deeds, which is a uh, scare break because the tailor shop is right next to the blacksmith shop, and the end is only one screen away. So you want to find your tailor person and in this building it's always the dude with the pink shirt okay so I'm gonna sell one of these magic hats I've got in my bag and he's gonna give me he's gonna say hey do you want to do a bulk order deed uh, you can make 15 exceptional cloaks like, do you want to accept this order I said okay it gives you the unfilled bulk order deed that you can fill later. And to turn one in, because remember we had that completed one, you just drag it onto his head, makes a little flute noise, and gives you a reward. Medium stretched hide deed facing south, and some gold, 62 gold. The gold scales, so the harder uh, bulk order deeds you turn in, the more gold you get. Actually, 62 gold was from selling the hat. It put the gold in my bank box. Let's see how much gold that was. Four thousand twenty. So, as you can see, definitely worth it to do these. That did not cost me 4,000 gold worth of materials to do. All right, moving right along. So the blacksmithing one, I grabbed a whole bunch of blacksmithing ones because I wanted to show you how people do what they call flips. To figure out how many flips you have for a day, you can uh, go to the uh, MOTD menu. And this is the day. And then you click on uh, this one here, and it has your BOD status. So, like, I have eight flips 
uh, per day. And it's our, I guess it's every 23 hours. I thought it was 24. Um, but I can do seven more tailoring BODs t today turned in and they'll give me fresh ones. So people do that so they get a chance to get the harder ones. For blacksmithing, they'll want like the Valorite or Verite uh, small pieces. And for tailoring, they want the the 10 piece exceptional leather six piece sets uh, because those yield a clothing blessed deed. So for blacksmithing, it shows I've got eight left and I grabbed, I think I grabbed eight deeds. So what you do is you just sell your whatever you got on you. Let me give you one. And now if I go and try to sell another item, he won't give me anything. You have to turn in one of these filled ones. And then sell. Now he gives you a fresh one. So I'm going to go through and do that. Long sword. Let's see if we get something nice. Large. Oh, also another tip that I didn't find out until later. Uh, the lost the small ones are harder to get, and you need a lot more of them. The large ones have become pretty common. So you want to have, it's a nice idea to have more than one blacksmith, but you'll want to have at least one of them with their skill locked at 99.9. .9. You cannot get a large BOD if you're at 100 skill. And you want more of the small ones. So the benefit is to lock it at 99.9. .9. By doing that and having two smiths, some people run three, uh, you'll you'll get enough larges you get more than enough larges on your blacksmith that's a hundred than you'll ever need this the smalls are the ones that are harder to get and the more sought after okay so he didn't give me one that time that means I'm probably out of flips yeah zero of eight and next bod i can still get one five and a half hours from now i can get one and then another five and a half hours after that i can get one uh but i can't get eight until tomorrow go ahead and turn in these other couple ones i grabbed because that you can still get a reward for them well, actually i am at max weight And I'm out of a region. Well, that's the thing I got. A strength pot. So let's see how much gold I got from turning in nine of those. 16,189. So not bad money, especially when you turn in the the more sought after ones, the six piece large uh, complete sets or 20 exceptional large complete sets. You get lots of money for those. But there are smarter ways to do this. Like I said earlier with the script, I've never ran a script on it uh, too much. So... I just do it casually. There are guys that'll like do this every single day. Not me. I just do it when PvP is lull and I get tired of farming. I'll just knock out some bulk order deeds and some of them I'll sell. Some of them I'll just turn in to get the stuff for. But it's pretty fun. You can get some nice stuff. You get the uh, rugs and uh, you can get these little uh, braziers.
Lots and lots of blacksmithing hammers. Mining gloves. These gargoyle pickaxes you get, you can take those mining and pull up elementals, which are kind of fun. So yeah, that's it. That's Grofus's basic guide to bulk order deeds. Uh, like the video if you like it. Subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos. And until next time, fairly well.